Hi, today we're going to see how to create a warp dispersion effect in GIMP. I will put the link of this image in the description box. So first we need to make selection of the person here. We need to put it on new layer. So now I'm going to select the select by color tool. I'm going to select the background. So left click. So here. So as you can see, the mode here is add to the current selection. I check the anti-aliasing and here the transparent areas are checked. And now I'm going to check the feather edges. I'm going to reduce the feathering to five. And now I'm going to left click here. So here it is. And now I'm going to increase this selection here. So now I'm going to select grow. Since we're selecting the background here, so that we are going to move this selection inward here to the person here to remove the white lines here when making our selection i'm going to i'm going to increase this selection by two pixels press ok and now as you can see we select by color to selected some parts of the eyes here so now in order to remove this part here just select the pre-select tool go to the mode here make sure the mode is subtract from the current selection and then I'm just going to draw here around the selected parts and then left click here to close the selection, then press enter. So here it is. Let's turn back the mode here of the free select tool to the replace the current selection in order not to forget. And now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to cut the background here. So control X and then control V. So control Z to undo. I didn't add an alpha channel, so right click, make sure to add an alpha channel, and then control X, and then control V. So here it is, as you can see, it's floating selection. Click on this icon here to paste it on a new layer. So, so here it is, here's our background, and now here's our person. Now I'm going to move it upward, so here it is, and now I'm going to duplicate this layer, so click on this icon, the person layer. And now I'm going to desaturate this layer. So go to colors, human saturation, and now reduce the saturation slider all the way down and then press OK. And now select the warp tool. So the warp transform here is move pixels. And now here are the settings I'm using. And now I'm just going to move here like this. So here it is. Press the plus on your keyboard to zoom in. So now let's reduce a little bit size and still here a little bit fix it. So control Z to undo. So here like this, press minus key on your keyboard to zoom out. And now let's select the move tool, select another tool here to confirm the warp. And then right click new from visible. You can still, for example, if you want, you can still change the background. So I'm going to create a new transparent layer fill it with transparency and then press OK. And now I'm just going to move it down and then let's select, for example, light blue color, this one here, press OK. And now I'm just going to drag it. So here like this, then right click, new from visible. So here it is. That's how you can create a warp dispersion effect in GIMP. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day and uh, till next time.